This is the spider web. Are you ready? Spiderweb. For this video, I'll be doing a battle between Ace the Dragon, Prime Apocalypse, and Venom Devilos. Now, this video was requested by the Bayverse, so huge shout out to him or her. Luke's boy, but that uh, could be wrong. Anyways, uh, this is a huge reference to the anime battle between um, Delta, Dante, and Arthur. And I believe Delta used them. Um, Erase Devilos, but to see how it, it probably would have played out in Hasbro form if, with the Venom Devilos is mighty interesting. Now, I will be using the um, Extreme Challenger base stamp. I believe I, I believe this is the Extreme Challenger. <laughs> this is a lot of Hasbro names I gotta keep up with, and I'll use this Sword Launcher exclusively for Apocalypse. Because you know. Five random shoutouts to these um, fans. Thank y'all so much for your support. All right, let's get to the battle. Yeah, who should I launch first? They're all very aggressive, so I couldn't go wrong either way, I guess. Uh, due to a met. Uh, wow. You know what? I'm gonna launch you know, Apocalypse last because. Um, Apocalypse has the weakest burst resistance. Right, three, two, one. Ah, oh, come on, man. So they're just gonna. So Apocalypse won that, I guess. But really, it's because, yeah, self. Not they just knocked each other out, bro. You doing that? Right. Yes, I got them all in. Ooh. Oh, Ace Dragon with that W. They both simultaneously crash into Apocalypse. And of course, Apocalypse goes down. You see, Delta, if you would have cooperated with Dante from the very beginning, you probably would have like, beat Arthur very quickly. Oh my gosh. Apocalypse had more spin power than both of these, and then it just burst. You know, the fact that I've had this sword launcher for such a long time, and it's not breaking. It's very cool. Oh my gosh. Oh wow, Devilos actually gets a W. Wow. Now if only Apocalypse could get close to winning. Because it just Well it did win one time. That was only because Dragon and Devilos crashed into each other. If I made these dudes battle in any other stadium, the battle would be like Uber short lived. Come on, get in. Look. Look. What's up? I'm gonna give Prime Apocalypse the Hasbro Sparking Launcher because it's the best sparking launcher in existence. Like, as of now, and it probably forever will be. <laughs> Alright. Do you doing that? Right. 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 Whoa. Okay. But even with the sparking launcher, you still lose because you're just weak. You're just weak, Apocalypse. You know what? I have a plan. I have a plan. I know exactly what to do after this. Two, two, one, left. Right. Right. Whoa! Come on, Apocalypse! Ah. Why is Ace Dragon the one getting most of the W's? Well, Hasbro did a great job on Ace. I guess I'll, I guess that's why. Compared to Venom Devils and Apocalypse, Ace Dragon is like the best out of the three. <laughs> Alright, get this damn out of here. Oh, but Spider, you just said- Okay, yes, I know. I know, but... I forgot I had this stadium. This stadium is also pretty big. So I might as well use this. Now, that Sparking Launcher doesn't really make that much of a difference, although it is cool. I'm gonna let it sit aside. I try not to use the Sparking Launcher way too much. Alright. Same for the sword launcher. Two to another. Dang dragon! Oh my gosh! 
Well, the Bayverse does have a Dante avatar. That's prob- Not avatar, um, profile pic. So that's probably why Ace Dragon's doing so good. It's like, oh my gosh, Dante is here. I gotta look great. Okay, so we've seen how Hasbro's, um, dragon looks like for, uh, Surge. And it- Oh my gosh! I do hope they remake the, um, Triumph Dragon with, with more coloring and stuff. That would be sweet. I said sweet. Um, what was that? Oh my god. I, you know, sometimes I hate launching bays. You two like. Right. He already lost so bad. That you know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, look at that. I sabotaged the battle. Get out of here. Look. You doing that? Uh. No sword. Oh wow, Apocalypse! I'm gonna let this round not count because you just fell in the. You just fell in there. You fell off the launcher onto. <sighs> okay, let's uh, try this again. Oh wow, Ace Dragon with the sword launcher. The Apocalypse doesn't like. It. Oh my god. Look. Look, it fell off the launcher again. Oh wow, this went from a three-way battle to Ace Dragon versus Venom Devilos because guess what? Final Apocalypse does not like launching. It lost so many times it just wants to rage quit. Okay, this basically was happening. Between that. Oh my gosh! Oh, Apocalypse, look, guys, guess what, uh, oh my gosh, so Apocalypse bursted, okay, it bounced off of my uh, bed stand, <laughs> and then flung right back in there, like, dude, just, you know what, just in there, oh, come on. <sighs> I don't like this, I really don't want this battle to reveal to be so short, but really if I just keep doing this, it's just gonna be Apocalypse bursting, Devil's running out of stamina, Ace Dragon getting the W every single time. <laughs> Why did Hasbro have to do this to Apocalypse? If Apocalypse was much stronger, it... just why? Be to him that- You know what? No. Oh my gosh. One more. This one more. Oh, so now they all are. Alright, Ace Dragon won throughout most of the video. I don't want to hear any debates. I'm just gonna give Ace a free win. <laughs> Only because it, it technically did win the most and is out of all the bays that kept falling off the launcher, Ace Dragon did it the least. So, yes, Dante. You're smarter than both Arthur and Delta. You're more competent. All right. Thank you for watching this uh, crazy video. They just kept bursting. Apocalypse and Devilos are just weak. Dragon is king. <laughs> this is why I gave Apocalypse an F tier. Maybe I should have gave Venom a C. Or a bit. I probably should have gave Venom a C. Did I give it a, I think I gave it a B in my ranking system. No, it deserves a C. Just because of this, it deserves a C. Alright, thank y'all for watching. Have a great day.